Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to our channel. So today is Monday, December the 4th, and I'm going to attempt to do a Weight Watchers food vlog. So update on Weight Watchers. I am down. I was down 25 pounds. So for my top weight at 226 when I started over in December of 2016 to 201, and that was, I think I measured, weighed in at 201 Saturday, maybe, Friday or Saturday, I can't remember what day I got on the scale. So that put me down um, 25 pounds. So I weighed this morning, Monday's normally my weigh day, um, so I'm not counting in today's weight because Monday is my official weigh-in day. And it is, oh, Monday is my official weigh-in day. So it is Monday. Never mind. I'm counting it then. Oh, my. I've lost, <laughs> I've lost some days here, y'all. I'm sorry. Um, so I weighed in this morning at 203.2. So that put me up 2.2 pounds just since Saturday or Friday, whichever day. But um, the church has brought meals in, and they have not brought in Weight Watcher friendly meals. And um, just being with everything, I have not been able to really do a lot of cooking or standing. Like I'm at the end of my energy right now. And I still have to grab a shower. And I just got out of bed. So I am going to make an, an attempt to do food vlog for the rest. Because I can't work out, I'm going to be focusing way more on the points. Because I'm restricted to working out until January. So, um... With that being said, I have been doing eye track bites traditionally, which is what I started with last year because it was affordable. Yesterday, I, because of all the changes with Weight Watchers and the freestyle program, I made the conscious choice to switch to do Weight Watchers. Um, I signed up for the six months online plan. That was, um, you get a free month, one free month. So I guess if I wanted to cancel at the end of this month, I could. I'm not sure how that works. I don't plan to do that. I plan to compensate for the, um, it's $19.99, $19.95 or something like that. They waive the um, setup fee. I didn't have the initial fee of $20. So when I did my enrollment yesterday, I paid $0. But I do have the six-month subscription to the online. So I downloaded the app and... Um, with that being said, I'm going to account for that $20 in my grocery budget. So I'm just gonna add it into my grocery budget, but I'm gonna add it in in January because I didn't have to pay anything this month. So with the new freestyle program, you know the points have changed. So I'm getting 23 points daily, still get 42 weekly points, and then if I have any leftover points, up to four points per day can be added or rolled over into weekly points and but your weekly points reset on so my points would set on Sunday because Sunday was the day I joined I don't weigh in until Monday but my points reset on Sunday so with that being said I am trying to I love my coffee which I just did a, a, a cup of coffee and I need to try to find a way to flavor my coffee. So when I use the um, sugar-free Coffee Mate um, Italian Sweet Cream for one tablespoon, it's zero smart points. But one tablespoon doesn't quite do it for me all the time. I can drink it black with no problem, but sometimes I just need a little something. So I'm trying this little concoction myself to see how it's going to work out um, for four ounces or half a cup of this unsweetened vanilla almond milk is zero points. So I'm going to do, and I put it in this um, cup thing, four ounces of the almond milk. I'm going to do one tablespoon of the sweet cream. And then I'm going to do two tablespoons of the sugar-free, this is the Tarani hazelnut coffee liqueur or coffee syrup, whichever. So I'm doing two tablespoons of that. And 
and then I'm going to do one tablespoon of vanilla. So I'm hopeful, because I know that the sugar-free is zero, that the vanilla is zero. It may not be, I'll have to go back and track it. But my hope is, if I've tracked, if I put it in right, and I'll have to go back and put it in Recipe Builder to see what it ends up being. But this whole thing right here is gonna be zero points, and I plan to use this throughout the day, not for one cup of coffee, because my coffee is not even this much. So I just plan to use this throughout the day. I'll keep it in the fridge, and if I need a little something, I'll just, you know, that's what, two tablespoons. So it gives me some color. I'll do three. It at least makes me feel like I have way more than what I probably have. Maybe four is better. <laughs> it's not light enough, but that's okay. Uh, better than what I have had traditionally. So for the moment, all I am having is a cup of coffee and I'm getting ready to make three eggs. Oh, I'm gonna do two eggs. Two eggs because eggs now are free on the freestyle program. So I'm gonna do two eggs and probably some mushrooms because I do have some that I need to use. And I think I'm gonna do some chicken breast in the eggs because chicken breast is now zero points as well. So I'm gonna get my breakfast stirred up here together and then I'll let you see what it looks like in just a minute. Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. So I am going to attempt this food vlog one more time. This is day number two. And the reason that you're just seeing this on day number two is because I forgot to film the rest of day number one. So I'm going to put that video at the front of this portion, but we are gonna food vlog for today December the 5th it's Tuesday so we're gonna food vlog so what I have here is I have eight slices of some salami um, I think this is salami it's not pepperoni it's salami this um, counted as three smart points I've got about a quarter of a large gala apple because my berries were not any good anymore so we are gonna go to the new Aldi that's opening here in our town on Thursday we may go on Saturday because it's a little bit less traffic. I have not decided, but I'll get fresh veggies then. I am having three whole eggs with a quarter cup of mozzarella and a quarter cup of uh, shredded cheddar cheese. Those are all zero points. And then I'm having a slice of ultra thin cheddar cheese. And that is counting as two smart points. I'm also having coffee with um, the zero tape, uh, the Italian sweet cream creamer plus some almond milk and that zero smart points so my breakfast this morning is coming in at five smart points i actually had rollover points from yesterday i was excited so um this is what i'm having for breakfast and um i'll see you back at lunch hey everybody welcome back so it is dinner time around here and i'm going to show you what we're having for dinner um, the other day, if some friends came over and they brought us some food for our meal. And we had some leftover, some of the um, Kirkland's brand chicken tortilla soup. And so what I'm having is one and a half cups of the chicken tortilla soup. One serving counts as two points. So I'm not sure if two serve, one and a half servings is going to be four or three points. I'll insert it to let you know. I tracked for one cup but I, when Alana put it together she didn't measure it quite right so it's about a cup and a half so I'll readjust my points for a cup and a half and I may even just make her make it two cups because it was only two points for a cup so it's pretty low and then we added in some chicken breast just the chicken breast and add in any other portion of the chicken on here I have a quarter cup of the shredded uh, cheddar cheese as well as a quarter cup of shredded mozzarella cheese for zero smart points and here I am going I am doing low carb but I have some of these Ritz kind of cracker things that we got with coupons so for 21 crackers it was four points it's the sour cream and onion flavored so four points there we're gonna say 
two points, two to four points for the soup. So that's about between six and eight points is what I'm having for dinner. Um, for lunch, I had two slices of thick cut bacon for four points. And I had probably a cup and a half of cauliflower rice. And I just saute that up in a pan. And I forgot to film that part. So it counted four points for my lunch. We're going to count between six and eight points for my dinner. I'm, I'm editing a video. so And I'm also sitting down. Um, so 23 points is what we're allowed on the freestyle program. Hey y'all. So, um, 23 points is what is allowed per day on the program. And I think so far today, I am coming in at 13 points so far from everything I've had from this morning up until now. So I have 10 points left. I can roll over as many as four points. So I still can eat six points and be okay and roll over four because um, on Saturday, Alana and I are going to a ladies clothing swap, a clothing and household swap. Um, and they're going to have light refreshments and I'm not sure what those light refreshments are. So I could roll over some extra points. I have 46 points so far because I rolled over four points from yesterday. So I have 46. So I could potentially roll over some points i probably will eat something else tonight i'm not real sure what i'll eat but i will either take a picture or i'll come back on and let you know what it is that i've had but so far today i'm clocking in at 13 points with 10 points still left so um if i eat anything else i'll come back and let you know what i've had to eat <laughs>